Guys, I got breaking fucking news. Uh, just found out. I don't know if he was terminated. I don't know uh, if he ended it himself. Uh, I don't know if this had anything to do with this petition against Susan Wajiki. He had a petition against Susan Wajiki. Got like 196,000 signatures. I signed it too. You know, that's, you know, me and Spencer Carter, we had a, uh, well, anyway, Spencer Carter's channel got terminated. He was about, he was on YouTube for like 12 fucking years, 13 years. He was on there a long ass time. I've been on YouTube 11 years. I've been on YouTube since 2009, so I've been on here a long time too. So, Spencer Carter has been on YouTube longer than me. I've been on YouTube since 2009 of April. April 26, 2009. I don't know what the hell happened. I, I don't know. If he got terminated, he's probably going to go spazzlistic. I mean, maybe he just got fed up with this shit and said, fuck it, I'm done. I don't know what. I don't know what's going on. So... I'm in Saginaw, Michigan right now. I'm on my way home from uh, Midland. I uh, did some flood videos. Uh, I did a live stream too. I got some flood videos on my other camera. I just got to upload them when I get home. Uh, and I got some more videos on my uh, of the, the rally in Lansing on my camera. I just got to upload them off my camera onto my laptop and get them up on YouTube when I get home. Uh, I might be going to Wolverine Lake tomorrow. They got some other protests going on. I don't know what boats boats on a lake or something. I don't know exactly what the freak is going on. But anyway, uh, Spencer Carter gone. Don't know what happened. Hopefully, you know. Hopefully, he makes another channel. We back. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I don't know. Don't know shit. So today was a long freaking day. The Midland Flood thing did videos there. Spencer Carter got terminated. A lot of shit going on today. Spencer Carter got terminated. The Midland Floods videos. I did that. I did the pro the uh the haircut protest thing in Lansing today. And my uncle died. I I posted it on another video I, on my camera. I talked about it. Uh basically what happened was I woke up this morning. Just another day. I'm thinking, okay, I got to get up. I got to get to this protest, you know. So I get up. I get in the shower. I get out. I have a cup of coffee like I do every morning. Uh, my dad, he uh, says to me, got something to tell you. I'm like, what's up? He's like, your uncle died. I'm like, oh, my God, which one? He's like, and he told me, I'm not going to say his name on YouTube, but he told me, hey, I'm like, well, that's the first, that's how I started my day. I found out my uncle died. He had a lot of drug problems. He had a lot of issues. I'm not going to, like I said, I'm not going to, I made another video. I was talking about in another, in another video for a quick minute on my camera, but he had a lot of problems. Um. I'm not going to go in details. I'm not going to put my family problems on YouTube. But let me just say that, you know, he, like my dad put it, he was dealt a bad card and he went the other way. He had a good career, was married, and life was going good, going good for him at one point. Got on the drugs and ended up getting divorced. His ex-wife ended up overdosing and dying like 16 17 years ago I don't know uh lost his house career everything do not get hooked on the heroin okay don't do it don't do it once don't do it at all for all the millennials watching don't do it it's not worth it it will fuck your life up and it fucked his life up I don't know the full details, but Waterford police found him this morning 
in a motel deceased. I guess from my understanding, uh, he didn't check out of his motel or whatever. And uh, I'm guessing the clerk did a welfare check. No, it was too early. No, that was too early. Okay, never mind. No, because I found out at about... It was like 9 a.m. this morning when I found out. And usually checkout time is 11, so... I don't know. I don't know the full details. I don't know. I don't even know how he died. It hasn't came out yet. Textology report or whatever hasn't came out yet. All I know is, I guess they were doing a welfare check on him. Maybe he didn't pay his rent or something. I don't know. They did a welfare check on him, and uh, I, I'm getting Waterford Police did a welfare check on him, I guess. And they, all I know is they found him deceased. The Waterford Police found him deceased in the motel this morning in Waterford Township. That's all I know. So... And I'm sorry for anybody out there watching. I'm not trying to put my family problems on YouTube, but just want to get it off my chest. So one day, it, it was a long freaking day today. And then, and then I found out Spencer Carter, his channel is terminated. So what the fuck? I, did, I, I never seen someone like Spencer Carter get in the boot. Maybe he got three strikes. I don't know. But anyway, uh, well, uh. More videos coming soon.